Locate the battery housing this position at the left rear corner adjacent to the fan. Loosen the three capture screws that hold the battery cover and remove the cover. If a Honeywell quality inspection seal is covering one of the screws, remove the seal completely using isopropyl alcohol. Locate the small connector connected to the battery. Probe the connector, the contacts, and measure the battery voltage while under load. The three pins on the connector have a positive voltage on the center pin, and the other two pins are both common and are attached to the negative terminal of the battery. Replace any batteries with a voltage reading of less than 2.4 volts DC. Separate the small connector and use the connector wire to solely extract the battery from the computer. Install the new battery and reinstall the connector. Honeywell IC800 battery part number 7014. 664-902. The parts can be obtained at Cessna Service Parts and Program, CSPNP. Check and record the replacement battery voltage by probing the pins at the connector. The battery voltage reading should be more than 2.4 volts DC. Reinstall the cover and hardware. Make sure the battery connector fits in the recess slot. Apply your quality inspection seal to one of the screws on top of the battery cover. After battery replacement, the custom database, navigation database, and aircraft database can then be reloaded and FMS setup option re-entered. Please refer to the pilot operating manual for procedure to load the NAV, custom, and aircraft database.